Hey guys, so today we are here with another haul, except all the stuff that we bought today is for prom, which already passed, but we're going to show it to you guys anyway, so let's get started. I guess the first thing that we'll start out with is something that we are very, very excited about because we've been wanting this for so long, but like every time we go into Sephora or Ulta, it's always sold yeah. out, of course, and then luckily we went to the mall and the lady told us that they had just gotten these like shipped to the store three hours before we went so lucky us yes. so we got the anastasia dip brow thank the lord it is mm -hmm. so beautiful it is definitely the best investment in makeup we've ever yeah. made it's like a gel eyeliner but for your brows but for your eyebrows mm -hmm. and it's so nice all you do is like dip it in and then you just put it on your eyebrows yes the mine is in the color ebony Mine's in the color chocolate. The good thing about this is that it like dyed my eyebrows Same. or something. Like it stained them. And I really like that because... And it lasts all day. Like you do not see it change color or anything throughout the day. So yeah. perfect. And the next place we went to was Target. Mm -hmm. And we just got some things that we needed for our clients. So I guess the first thing we both got were these cosmetic wedges, latex free. Anyway, we just used this with foundation. I don't even know like what I got from Target <laughs> and what I got from somewhere else, so I'm just gonna dive in. Whoa! -ho -ho. That was on point. Was it? Thanks, girl. You're welcome. Okay, so wherever we went, the next thing I got was the Queen Helene Mint Julep Mask, and I got this because I remembered how much I like I loved the way it made my face feel when Kelly got it, and we mm -hmm. wore it like all the time in New York. Yeah. So I decided to get one for myself, it's and bomb. I must say it's working, like, because with this, I've been using, like, a new cleanser, and I've been using my Clarisonic, and I'm just breaking out. All the pimples are coming out in my life mm -hmm. at the moment. The first thing I got from e.l.f. is the Contouring Blush and Bronzer in St. Lu Lucia, Lucia, and I have another one of these, but it's in a different color, but this is what it looks like. It kind of reminds me of Nara's Orgasm. Oh, you can see your cells. <laughs> Nars <laughs> Orgasm Blush and Laguna Bronzer Duo, and it's just super pigmented. I don't know if you could see that. It's too washed out, but they're very nice, and they're really natural looking too. The next thing I got is something I'm very happy to get because this is one of my favorite foundations, and it's just so good. It's the Revlon Color Stay, and I think this is one of the best foundations. Seriously. Like, I guess I haven't tried many like high-end ones, but... This is still right up there with my favorite like MAC foundation and my Makeup Forever one. Like this shit is the bomb, guys. Yes. Perfect for oily skin too. Yeah, like it's like the perfect coverage because I feel like it covers a lot but it still looks natural. Mm -hmm. So I, I think it's a good like everyday foundation yeah, too. Yeah, it's really nice. The next thing I got, I think it's this, is the e.l.f. matte lip color in Praline. And this is what it looks like. It's what I'm wearing right now. It's just a really nudie pink color and it lasts all day. I love it. And it's a perfect matte neutral shade for my lips because I don't like colors that wash me out. And I noticed this doesn't really wash me out. So I've been kind of running low on moisturizers and I've been wanting something that, I don't know, could help. Like I want something that makes me matte but then still like moisturizes my skin. So I thought I would try the Cetaphil Oil Control Moisturizer. It has SPF 30, and it is actually formulated for acne prone skin. So it's not gonna focus, sadly, but it's the purple one. And I don't know, it feels really nice. Um, I feel like it's been helping me with my oil like these past couple days, but again, that could just be like me like thinking the product is working, you know, I'm always like iffy on that, so I don't know, so far I really like it and it makes my skin feel really smooth after I wear it, so it's nice. And I also got a new moisturizer because my other one is running out, so I decided to pick up the Formula 10.0.6 Picture Perfect Day Daily Moisturizer with SPF 15 <laughs> Guava and Vitamin C. Oh, you can't even see that. But it's part of that brand that has the mattifying moisturizer. And I was going to get that, but I decided to try this one instead because it had SPF. And since it's been super hot and sunny lately, I decided I need to protect my skin. So I've only tried this one so far, and I actually kind of like it. That it's works so out. hot, guys. Like, 
it the 90s every day mm -hmm. and it is like never that hot here yeah so it like just kind of hit us like, yeah and we got slurpees every single day <laughs> yeah slurp slurp becca i picked up the just another duo lash glue because you know prom mm -hmm. you're gonna want some lashes and it's just the white one everyone knows what this is so yes. I don't really know like what to say about it I mean it's nice also for prom I decided to pick up the elf glitter primer and I really wanted to try the Too Faced glitter insurance I think but it's like $22 and I was like I'm not gonna invest in that that's too much and this is only two dollars and it works just as well I believe because I tried it on all the girls um, that I did makeup on and it lasted all night so I think this is a really good dupe for that. I wanted to get a new mascara because I've kind of been running low on the ones that I've been using but I think I just also wanted to repurchase this but I got it in the small one because so I don't know I thought I just want the small one and it's just a Benefit Their Real Mascara. This is definitely one of my favorites. It works so well at like separating the lashes but still like giving them length and volume. It's just perfect. Also from e.l.f. I got the cream eyeliner because my friend Amber suggested it and she highly recommends it. So it's just the cream eyeliner in black and this stuff lasts all day and it's just amazing. It's really nice to blend out too. And then I this from elf and I didn't even use it on anyone it is the elf HD blush and it is in the color headliner that's what the packaging looks like it's kind of like the I know makeup forever has um, they have HD blushes like this so and I've always wanted to try those so I thought mm -hmm. I'd just try this first so cute yeah it's cute mm -hmm. it just looks like that and it has like a pump so and then I put some on my skin. I don't know if you can kind of see it right there, but I got it so I can use it on like lighter girls. <laughs> um, but I don't know. I didn't end up using it, so I don't really know how well it works, and I don't know like how well it applies to the skin. So I don't know. Maybe I'll do a review on it later. But as for right now, it's just a pretty color. Okay. The next thing we both got is the Elf yes. High Definition Under Eye Setting Powder. And um, Shan XO talks about this product so much, so I uh, suggested that we both get it, and we really like it so far. Yeah, it's cute. And it just <laughs> looks like this. It has a little sifter, and it's like a light pink translucent color. Yeah. It's really nice. And I like it because it's small. Mm -hmm. And I always want to, like, bring my powder with me, like my face powder, and then, like, my under eye powder, which is usually my Ben Nye banana powder, but that thing is so big, yeah. and I don't like taking it around. And it so. smells a lot, too. Yeah, and this is just, like, cute and small. Mm. I can take it anywhere. Yes. Okay, so I also picked up two brushes. This first one is the e.l.f. Small Angled Brush, and I picked this up for the um, dip brow that we bought, and it works really, really well. I did not want to spend $18 on the brush that Anastasia has, and then... I also picked up the e.l.f. Flawless Concealer Brush for the under eye setting powder that we got. I guess the last thing I got, which I didn't really buy, but I mean, I still got it, right guys? Mm -hmm. It is the Sephora like birthday gift thing. It was my birthday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it just came with like a little mascara, the Smoky Extravagant Mascara. Oh, that mascara is bomb. And okay. Y'all know how much I love the Makeup Forever Smoky Lash, and I really wanted to try this out, and I finally got it, and the brush is so cute. Mm -hmm. After I use it, my lashes look like mm -hmm. they look, oh my God. gods just touch them. They look like false. Mm -hmm. That's right. Mm -hmm. And then it also just came with a little mini oh, lipstick. So I have the same one. 6N. I don't know, but it's so pretty. It's just like a nude color. And it's really nice. I think it works well on all skin tones mm -hmm. because it looks great on Kelly, and I think it looks great on me too. <laughs> and then the last two things that I bought were from Ulta, and they're having a buy one, get one free deal on their Freeman products. So I picked up the facial anti-stress mask, and this is the one that I've shown in previous videos. It's amazing, but I ran out of it, so I picked it up again. And then this is a new one. It's the Facial Brightening Mask in Golden Grain. 
and it's kind of like a gel mask and it feels really nice on the skin so I like this so Becca got me this hat for my birthday thank you Becca I love you girl and I told her I would wear it in a video so I'm wearing it so that is it for our haul we hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe to our channel mm -hmm. if you aren't already and definitely follow us on Instagram and Twitter at JKBDO8 um, we're working on kind of posting more mm -hmm. on that so definitely get ready to see more from us on yes. those and we'll see you in the next video bye, bye guys, guys.